the major development projects in the hospital are the staff house and then the mater maternal and child health complex. Yes, you will have to help us with your team and your group to equip that place because it is a maternal and child health complex. Yeah, we need, we need beds there. We need uh, uh, beds for adults and we need beds for children. We also need bed for neonates. Yes. Ministry of Health has given us some equipment, but it's not enough. Yeah. We always put our hands open for public-private partnership. I never thought about <laughs> I never thought we would have that complex, but we've had it and it's about to get completed. This is now the new complex. Wow. This is the new maternal and child health wow. building by government of Uganda. Wow. wow. This is called the maternal and child health complex. The first three followers are for maternity and then the last blocks are for the children. It has a theater, then it has a children's component where we keep preterm babies like the other one, which is small, but this one is much bigger. The first the ground floor is going to be a component for, I mean, an ICU, which have been lacking in the Greater Massacre. So you are going to have an ICU. The five-storied building, very big, which is going to be receiving all the patients from the Greater Massacre. We really encourage the Minister of Health through Dr. Diana Twine to increase the budget for the Massacre Regional Health Hospital building can be completed on time and equipped so that we really come in and be able to give better services to the patients of Greater Massacre.